All right, we're back. Last time, uh, whew. <laughs> today, it's time to finish this job. Zip. I mean, Spore wasn't even a very good video game. There's a good running theme of, like, people trying to remove themselves from war, but it never works out. Like, war will find you. <laughs> Both these options are very legit. It's like, alright, let's begin assembling the troops. I really don't feel up to it right now. Which is entirely <laughs> kind of legit. But yes, to war. Now if I remember right, your first action in this fight is a free one because he tries to use the spores on you. Or the, uh, the I, flower. I don't remember. Have you already started the combat? Yes. Okay. But as always, I'm going to... Uh... When was the last time you made a save state? Exactly, I'm doing it right now. Drat. Why? I haven't Nothing. done it yet. Well, when was the last time prior to this? I don't know. Why? Yeah, then don't worry about it. I was going to say go get some gear on some people. Because you just lost Grammio. I know, but, but you know... I need to choose a party anyway, and they're going to force me to take some people, so I was waiting. Uh, anywho. There's that quick save. Alright. So, um, because our first action is free, we're going to boost our charge power and just go in with a charge. Oh, I should emphasize something, too. The hero is no longer the strongest charge because yep. we lost Gremio. Yeah, but like, Gremio is super fucking dead. Like, he is gone. Mm -hmm. If you had the blinky mirror on Gremio, the blinky mirror would be gone. Anywho. This. Oh. Is not what I was expecting. <laughs> Uh, by the way, it is not a free action, the first move. Whoops. Uh, luckily I went in with a superpowered charge, so... Okay, I it looks like all the soldiers are wearing pots on their head. <laughs> yeah, the enemies, it kind of looks that way, doesn't it? Your people, too. Just golden pots. I don't believe his stuff moves into your inventory. Some of it does. It matters from what the stuff is. Alright, we made some people turn traitor. Let's see if we can see what they're going to do next. Alright, uh, it's a mystery. I'm going to say because it's Malich, they're going to go with magic. So, go elves. Malich attack. I was right. And next is a bow attack. Maybe. Yep. Alright, this that should be a win then. No, they have a few stragglers. And I'm out of Wipe others. Them out. Let's go with magic. Hell yeah.
Uh, newbie, I know you like this game and everything, but this is incredibly silly. Oh no, this game is very silly. Like I said, it kind of goes back and forth between the between silly and very serious at the same time. Yeah, okay. Uh, the oh. next game, uh, War Battles, are like tiny Fire Emblem maps. Alright, so Flick and Victor were forced into our party. Uh, let's Come see. Come on, put in the B team. Yeah, who? That's the question. Um, Tails. Ah, Koro Mimi was used a ton last time. Okay, fine. Someone... Let's see. Who did you say was good? Hellion? Hell yeah. Yeah, bring her. All right, and then let's get, let's throw in some some joke characters. Kirkus. Uh, <laughs> Kirkus is not even a joke. Well, he is a joke, but for the wrong reasons. Kai is pretty good. I guess yeah, Pawn and Kirkus need to get leveled, but mm. Pawn very much needs to get leveled. There's time. You said Sheena was pretty all right. I don't know. Give, give me some characters. Just give me some characters. I've just find anyone who's medium or long range and throw them in. Let's put Galoof. Lorelei. Because you've already got a bunch of short range. Well, hey, Hellion's was... just going to be in the back spell casting. I'd, you know, go with Sheena. Why not? What are those thieves that you uh, rescued? In the one episode that I was in, <laughs> first session. Way back um, when. You know what? Kryn. Yeah, I know. Uh, what are the the two of them? Like the actual thieves? They're Kryn, Sedona, and who's is it? Kryn? Yes. No, it's Varkus. Varkus and Sedona. The thieves. Uh Oh, Bandits. those thieves. The guys that aren't actually thieves. Yes. Yeah, those guys. Alright. Let's get the formation down. This is fine. And, uh... Time to go back to the palace. <laughs> you know it, you love it. Inventory management. I would actually laugh if it was like, Oh, well, you have Hellion in your party... She can't use the blinking mirror. Wait. <laughs> Hold up. What? <laughs> uh, so the reason that we did Varkus and Sedona are uh, they have a unite attack. But their weapons are super weak. Yo, does it do anything to hone up, to sharpen up spellcasters' weapons? No. Okay. Oh, by the way, you should probably check the thing in Discord. I think there's a couple messages in there. Uh, alright. Ah. Okay. I've been informed of a thing, pretty much. The thing with Pawn is coming up very soon. <laughs> so, oops. We need to bring Pawn. Yeah, Just if you're going to take gear. him, you, you need to get him, like, the best gear and hone up his weapon to max. Okay. But if you just move him to the other side of the board, doesn't it become queen? Yes. Accurate. Uh... One of these days, I'll bring a spellcaster in my party and have them in for more than, like, an episode. <laughs> I, try, I, I I ran with Luke for a little bit. I did not put Pawn in. I just ejected Eliana from the party. Which <laughs> 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 is actually, no, fuck you. 
I think that a uh, blacksmith in Milik's pl- uh, domain can level your uh, weapon up to like 12. Um, I'll be fine with whatever the base can do. It'll be fine. Yes, we're good. Alright. Uh, you. Wow. Lucan just comes with a bunch of fucking medicine, and I kind of love that, actually. That makes sense. One of these days, I won't be kind of, like, forced to use certain characters. <laughs> There are some times where you actually get a pretty open party. Yeah, next time you have uh, the opportunity, all spellcasters. I don't think there's ever a time where you can do all spellcasters, actually. It's not a terrible idea. All spellcasters and uh, main character. I and have put, only cast spells. Maybe I need to buy some armor. Yes. I just, I just, put, a, I just put a headband on Marcus. Newbie, stop being... <laughs> stop it. Just go buy stuff. Oh, jeez. I need to, uh... I need to take some stuff from people. Also, I'm not trying to be stingy. I'm trying not to fucking, like, over-curve myself here. I don't think you will. <laughs> Sedona, Sedonia. Can either of them use shields? No. Do I have the steel shield for foot now? Yes. Feather the pond. Fur cape the pond. Hey, <laughs> hey, who wants, um. Does anybody want, uh. Kremio's old cape. No. That's that's pretty dark. You sure? It's still warm. Seems like there's some yeast on this cape. Eh, just brush it off. Yeah, I wouldn't touch that. Yo, Pawn has a fucking magic level. Hell yeah. I'm starting to think I'm not very good at this game. What are you talking about? Starting? Whoa. Rude. You're fine. so hard if this inventory would just sort itself a little bit better. Man, if all my... the fuck are wooden shoes and why do I have them? They're for dancing and they're called clogs. They're amazing. Fair. fair the last set of uh like the last storyline um give me way more armor 
Hmm. I should probably should probably take out some medicine. A bit. Whoops, you didn't need one. You don't need one. I'm right about this game having like a weird glitch where uh like if you put a like just a barely medicine away, it'll get, just get refilled full. It might. I forget actually how it works. <laughs> Hit the headgear, which is just a, a upgrade for everyone. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you what. What? I'll. I'll limit myself in in the situation of I'll buy one piece of new gear, like the best gear of that type for everyone. There you go. Goes all the pawn. Get rid of those pointed hats. Headgears all around. And I think that half helm goes to Burkus. Because for some reason he can't equip certain types of headpieces, which is really weird. Like the first time I've seen that in a character. How expensive is armor? Yeah, the only thing better than what I have on people right now is the magic robe. And uh, the ninja suit, so it's, it's just not worth it to spend that much money. Gotcha. The helmets, though, I was using way outdated shit. Alright, let's just clear yeah, up the Yeah, the ninja suit was only six points difference, it's not that big. Yeah, let's just drop these helmets because we're going into a dungeon, we're probably gonna get a bunch of shit, and I need, inventor need inventory space. Okay, and the nice thing is we don't even have to. All right, that was only 10 minutes of inventory management. It's not bad for a JRPG. <laughs> sure. All right, it's all content from here on out though. Can Vicky mess up in this game? I think she can actually. Let's look at myself over one more time. Whoa, Marcus and Sedona are level like 14. They'll level up quick. Yeah, these guys are good. Let's see that Unite attack. See, Pawn barely took any damage. That was pretty good for being level 13. Holy <laughs> crap. You know, this party's not that bad. Let's see how many levels they gain. Three, four, five, uh, only five. Go figure. Oh my god. What? Oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah. I was just doing a goof! I <laughs> need to go sleeping in it. Actually, all I'm losing is hell fingers. I'm fine. Everybody just crits. Oh, these things actually hit pretty hard. Oh, I wonder if there's a boss in here. If there is, you'll be fine. Who are you? Eh. 
Yeah, especially with fucking bandit attack. That move kicks ass. Everybody is just critting. What the fuck? I think you have a team that has a lot of skill. I'll say. Yo, so these bandits are pretty alright. I like, chalk this up to another example of just like... Yeah, uh, their damage went up by a hundred something after gaining those four or five levels. Hey, what I say about like, don't worry, the dungeon will give me equipment. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm not like, want to spend all my money immediately. Except this is a dead piece of equipment, it's not good on anybody else. Apparently Victor just had some really shitty armor. He had leather armor on. Oh wait, I don't have hell fingers. Right. You've got the new move, you should show that off. Deadly fingertips. Black Shadow. Oh, this is the move that, um... No, it's not. No, it, it isn't. It looks very similar. Wow, that just killed them. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, fuck. So are you getting some levels? Yeah, a lot, actually. Like, the, again, leveling in this game is really good. Spark Crystal. Change, no idea, man. Change order of attack. Yeah, okay. That's nice and vague. I think that balcony is where he is, so you might want to fight a couple, just a couple more battles. Get on up to a nice even 30. That shouldn't take too long. Especially with those nightmares. I got another opal. I hate you so much. Yeah, so there's a... Like, that is why we're getting so... Oh, here we go. Defend, so what do opals defend, do? Defend, defend. What do you mean, levels? What? What do opals do? Oh, they're to recruit a character. Ah. Uh... They're a rare drop. They're like the nameless urn, but a different character. Mm-hmm. That was oh, geez. not worth a Hellfinger, by the way. <laughs> or whatever the fuck. Dark Shadow. Black Shadow. Zort. Wow, that really fucked up. Flick, actually. I think the only things in here that really give experience at this point are the uh, Nightmares. You know, throw that medicine on Flick. And actually, let's heal up Pawn. Whoop doop 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 doop. Just give me one more nightmare. Let's just fast forward into a nightmare. Highway to the nightmare zone. It's one nightmare. That might be enough. Oh, just barely not enough. Alright, this will be enough. Alright, level 30 on pawn. That's good. Yeah, it should be good enough. Lich, I'll get you. I was like, why is Camille here? Oh, right. Grimio owed her money. Yeah. I think that's the quote-unquote official party for this one. 
there's just no boss fight. This whole fucking side story had no boss fights. Yup. So, we are at another crossroad, similar to last time. Again, your heart may be telling you that th this guy killed Gremio. Fuck him. But, he was being mind controlled. So the correct answer is it's not his fault. Those black runes are pretty weird. And there you see the good turning point for Flick of acknowledging you as a leader. And there you actually find out why the Emperor is acting weird. Because he is doing what Wendy wants, because Wendy looks like his late wife. Ah. Do you know there's a song by the association called Wendy? Probably. I'd believe it. Do 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 Alright, so we need to bring the witch in the next set, right? Sweet. Probably. Stallion, what's up? <laughs> I like to think that Stallion is literally the uh, the army's runner. It makes sense. I'm just like, if a message needs to get someplace, just give it to Stallion. He will get there in seconds. He's aerodynamic with that nose. Well, his whole gimmick is that he moves fast. Like, if you have him in your party, you can run. So, he sprint shoes. Exactly. He's okay. double plus sprint shoes. Wait, so, does he pick you up and run with you? Sure. <gasps> we have ninjas. It's like the speed force. We have ninjas. Save right here before you do the thing. Or did you already start the conversation? I already started the conversation, but I can, you know, I can always hit the button, the magic button. He's good enough. Sure. It's here, finally, the day. You were part of the Liberation Army, and your father was a general in the Empire. Eventually the time would have to come where you would have to face your father. Yep. Um... All right, this is a point of no return. You cannot say no. This isn't even like a battle of X look. No, this is this is the fight with my dad. Yeah. Nothing else. It's my dad. Ninjas, they always succeed. Man, what are those guys riding on? Horses. Sure. 
Uh, armored cavalry is a charge attack? Yes. No, it's not. It is a special maneuver. Yeah, it's a charge attack. Just one that always works. Probably should have did thieves first. Thanks for the money. Yoink. Yeah, so I think they just do armored cavalry each time, and you, uh... Yeah. Actually, nothing works. Yep. That's what happens when heavy cav meets just about anything else. Oh, this is specifically Tio's charge. Boink. Yeah, it's scripted. The only reason I saved state was just to make sure that nobody can die. Oh my god, what are those things? They're dinosaurs. <laughs> Alright, this is why we were prepping Pawn. I like this. Pawn, I'll see you later, or good luck. I'll see him later. I mean, yeah, I'm saying I'll see you later. Yeah. Alright, fine, good luck. <laughs> I'm not saying, like, no... I can't, like, you'll be good, you'll survive, I'll see you later. So, <laughs> it's been a while since we've, uh, we've seen a certain thing. Yeah, so this is a one-on-one -on -one duel between Pawn and Tio. Yep. This is this is why you have to level up and equipment up Tio or er, Pawn. Yeah, because everything plays into this fight. Yep. Uh, actually, I'm just not gonna fuck up trying to make a safe state. I'm just gonna do this through the menu. Safe state zero. All right. Yeah, everything plays a role into this. So like your level, your equipment, everything. Um. Start with the desperate attack. No, with because a regular he, attack. Yeah, he is defending. This is, like most of the special battle types in this, this is a rock, paper, scissors. Is that what you got? Now it's my turn. I'm going to say normal attack. Yes. Yeah, so you should desperate him. Oh, boy. What? He is, um, stronger than a normal man. Mm-hmm. Luckily, I can counter. I don't think you have to deplete his gauge all the way. Yes, you do. You do? Yes. <sighs> I may have fucked up. Yes. <laughs> That's what I was trying to tell you earlier. Don't worry, I am rolling the dice hard. 
So Desperate Attack must go through Defend, right? No, Desperate Attack, uh, it, it is extremely good if it hits, it does a ton of damage. Um, oh shit. Impossible take that as, yeah, you're, you're doing good. Yeah! <laughs> you got really lucky. I feel that fits more thematically with the story of Pawn walking into a, like, pretty much doing a suicide mission. See, to you is his uh, lack of strategy there. He shouldn't have been in front of Pawn, but a bit to the left. <laughs> Pawn can attack him there. If he had chosen to use attack three times, he would have wrecked you. Yeah. Luckily, he didn't. Yeah. Again, thematically, I like the way that went down way better. Ooh, hey, Newbie, what happens if you lose that? Pawn fucking dies. Yes, he does. You get more magic? What do you mean, do you get more magic? Oh. <laughs> No. <laughs> nope. And you are also kicked out of the true ending if he dies. Yep. Uh, the true ending hinges on... <laughs> Pawn, where's my food? Pawn, you just almost died. <laughs> um, the true ending requires you recruiting all the characters. Somebody <laughs> dies, whether it be in war or like that, Can't you are locked out of the true end. Yes. Gremio being the exception. Grimio yes. always happens. Yeah, Grimio is super dead. I think Grimio may like be related to Mario and Luigi. It's a me, Grimio. Yeah. To be fair to Pond, he did say I'll be back in time for dinner, so when he's saying, where's my food, it's one of those, dude, I just almost died, where's my food? <laughs> yeah, where's my goddamn food? But you see, Mario and Luigi get empowered by fungus. Oh. My heart skipped like 20 beats. Mm hmm. <laughs> so did mine. We said, Yeah, I got this. I'll be fine. Thinking, Oh, newbie, I hope this does not come back to bite you later. I could have sworn, like, I, I always kind of half heartedly leveled up Pawn, and he was, it was enough. It was pretty much like, As long as you don't ignore him. But I guess it was the gear. I guess I didn't have good gear on him. Mm. Also, you didn't have him at the max uh, weapon thing, which makes a big difference. But it worked out, and like you said, it's better this way. Oh, I didn't have the max that was possible. I did the max from the base. Yes, you could get him another three levels up, and I think that actually upgrades his weapon. Mm. And here you go. There's, you get the lore here about the true runes. I don't think anybody in... Hold up just a moment. I don't think uh, anybody canonically has two has ever had two true runes. I actually... Doesn't three establish that that's impossible? Yeah. Uh, uh, three establishes that one person who has a true rune cannot have another one, but he can... He or she can give that true rune to somebody else. Ah, uh, there you go. All right. What if you have two false runes? Is that kind of a true rune? No, two wrongs don't make a right. Or two false don't make a true. Got it. Two no's make a yes. Alright. Uh, well, now that we, uh, we survived literal hell, 
Um, hey, guess what? The recruitment drive. Uh, the only characters we need in our party right now. Um, how do I? Do I do I fully even come back? How do I set up a party? All right, yeah, there we go. Just need to re. re the just needed to reset everyone. All right, we need uh, Taiho and Yamku. Speaking of characters, are we gonna that, go recruit some pirates? Yeah, speaking of characters I haven't used in forever. Pawn, you you get the rest. Maybe forever. <laughs> yeah, I might not touch Pawn ever again. Put Pawn in the back of the shelf. Yeah. He's good. He he. You you done good, Pawn. Uh, who was I? I was gonna use Helion. Yeah, let's bring her out. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, he's been pawned off. Mlitch. And uh. Yeah. How about uh. Right over his head. <laughs> I choose to ignore. Okay. You could also take uh Fusu Lu, the Tiger Man. Yeah. yeah fuck yeah. Why not? So, does Pawn go out every seven years for a mating ritual? That one... I... You lost me. Really? It's the Pawn Far. Mm. Oh, jeez. Christ. <laughs> That's a Star Trek thing, right? Yes. Yeah. Alright. Let's take a look, quick look at the old rock. Yep, there he is right there. Hella dead. You might need to level up before going to talk to these pirates, by the way. <laughs> oh, yeah, easily. Uh, oh, we'll... try to find that um, uh, forbidden or forgotten book or forbidden urn or whatever it is. Um, Well, uh, probably what I'll do is we do need to stop in Malich's house. Yeah. So, oh, good call. Yeah, I'll hop in there, get a level or two. 12 or 20 depending on EMQ's level I'm going to re reiterate this again this is why I crimed yeah new criminal but it's um, only white collar crime right something like that wait red F collar Fusu Lu uses an axe yeah, he said it when you recruited him that uh, my axe could uh, cause earthquakes felt miles away or something like that. Don't Yamku um, and Taiho have a United Attack? They do. What's the largest United Attack you can get? Uh, the... The, uh... Alright, so you have to re... re uh, the... You have to recruit a series of blacksmiths in order to up what you can smith. Mm -hmm. uh, there are six, or five. Are there five or six? Five. Five. There's five. Uh, you have to recruit five over the course of the game, and all five of them together have a unite attack. The amount of times that you can fit all five of them in your group are very small. Oh, wait, the storehouse was right there. Alright, time to detach some people. He was fine. <laughs> but if you get all the black Oh, myths... piss. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Oops. Ah, inventory management, hooray. Well, that's that more. Oh, I just took all of Tears gear off. Well, don't cry about it. You are pushing your luck so bad tonight.
choose no to ignore, to, huh? There's no need to shed a tear. No, I got it. Oh, okay. I'm just choosing not to acknowledge it. And I also said you're pushing your luck. <laughs> ah, that whole ignoring through acknowledgement thing. I think that was his understated warning of, do it again, I dare you, I will kick you out. <laughs> I'm not that mean. I never said you'd do it. I'll, I'll take care of it. Please do not kick out friends for doing a bad pun. A bad pun? No, not one. I've done a couple already. Malich is also one of our characters that has a forced item. Yeah, I gotta say, the pun potential... Sorry, the pun potential... That wasn't even intended. The pun potential of this sure. party is not very high. Did you de-equip tier? I did. Ah. Yeah. It was it was very much an accident. I was going through a bunch of people all at once and just accidentally slapped him. I do enjoy how there's not a unequip everyone who's not in the party currently button. Yeah, that would be fantastic. It would be fantastic if I got get somebody that fucking could equip this silver necklace. Oh, you did. The pirates you had last time, I think they could. The thieves? The bandits, yeah. I don't believe so. Uh... I do appreciate that Malich can equip feminine equipment. Yeah, look up real quick. Who can equip the silver necklace? And up right now. People who have access to and this thing, K armor class. Yeah, that's helpful. I'm I'm looking, man. I know. I, I'm not I'm not sassing you, I'm sassing guides. Gone can equip it. Oh, and as and, and can Kuro Mimi. Of fucking course he can. They're the only ones that can equip it. Oh, so it's kobold armor class. It's probably a, probably a dog collar. Wait, wouldn't that cause him to you know start smoking? Or is he not a werewolf? No, a werewolf. A werewolf. Werewolf. Where where kobold? Yeah. Have you oh. seen that Mystery Science Theater episode with the werewolf? Where one of the actors could not say werewolf to save her life? That, Whoops. That, that owns. It's amazing. Is that a werewolf? Alright, front row is pretty tanky. Back row, not so much, but they're also 20 levels lower. <laughs> okay. Yeah, Yamku needs to really step it up with levels. He's never been in a party. <laughs> We're gonna fight some guys. Hey, you wanna come here? Uh, am I even No. <laughs> yeah, he's never been in a party, whereas Taiho fought an undead dragon. <laughs> yeah, an undead dragon that was I shouldn't have been so, like, strong, even though it was already dead. Jesus Christ. Wait what a minute, it? what? Like, you shouldn't have been posing what? even though you were dead. What? What? What's the what for? Oh, that, that makes sense, seeing as they're on our front gates. Oh. Actually... It's because these two idiots made me a better boat. <laughs> yeah, every so often when Vicky can't send you places, it's one of those, Hey, moron, walk outside. <laughs> Alright, how about now? Now, Vicky, can you send me places? Okay. They made you a speedboat. Why are you teleporting? D teleporting is faster. It's a speedboat. You can go water skiing. You. Come to my castle. Yeah. 
I don't even know what you do. What? Who? Clone. Oh, he's the um welcome to the castle person. Uh... He actually does something else much, much later in the game. And an army battle no less. So you're just, you know, recruiting NPCs to say inane shit. Pretty much. There is actually an NPC that does nothing but say inane shit. By the way, we're back to the castle because um, I'm forgetting something very, very important. The opal. Look. Yeah, I was about to... <laughs> Movie, please! This music sped up is my new, like, fucking sound of hell. <laughs> These cells are nothing! That should be the new following sound. Motherfucker. What? You can't even sell the opal, because they don't want you to get rid of it. But I yeah, have exactly. two. Why don't you just recruit the person twice? I don't know if that works. Alright, we're here. We're back. And we're back. There's a new dancer. La la la, I'm the world's, be the world's best dancer, she says. You sure are. So is this a person you get to just dance in your cave, or can she fight? We already pit recruited the dancer. Wait. Okay, she did actually take an opal. That's a, that's the backup dancer that took the place of the dancer that we got. Alright, Esmeralda, and then we need to go to Castle. Ah, well, here's the enemy that I need to kill. I have not rested in an inn. It's okay. You'll get a whole bunch of levels. Builds character. Actually, this guy doesn't give very good experience. Can't you also get the urn from this person? Yeah. That's, that's, that's why he's doing the fight. That did 400 da weapons, right. So, Pallion has a unique kind of uh, rune. It's a stronger version of the Earth rune, which means that the level 2 Earth rune spell is now the level 1 Mother Earth spell, and the 3 becomes the 2, and the 4 becomes the 3, and then there's a special slot if you get her up that she has a special 4th level spell that wouldn't have been on the Earth rune. Yep. Uh, does this have combo magic in it? No. That's not till the second game? Yeah, it's not for later. Okay. Alright, so remember those people that were like, I hate Malich, he's a jerk. Well, now I'm gonna show up with Malich, and they're gonna be like, wow, thank you, Malich was a jerk. <laughs> yeah. They only heard about this guy from stories, they don't know what he looks like. Well, the guy on the bottom floor, the painter, that's different. The guy on the top floor, freely, is like, no, you're my master, it's good to see you again, I think. Alright, also that's why Fisherman Attack is that goddamn good. It's because it knocks him out. Alright, so Ivanov is a painter. And will paint stuff for us. But what would he possibly paint? The box art. He yeah, updates all the portraits. I'm not even joking. He he does a painting when you give him paint, and it is the box art. So when you said that they're useless characters... Yeah. You're talking about this guy. There are many, many fluff characters. She was right there. Who? The person you're trying to recruit? Yes. I believe that's a dude, actually. Is it? I'll see a portrait in a moment. Looks very feminine at the very least. 
oh, I'm not going to disagree with you on that, but a lot of characters in this game look like one or the other. For example... Uh, actually, I could see it. Uh, when I first saw Sheena, I thought Sheena was a lady until I, they said my son. I went, oh, okay, my fault. I misunderstood. Yeah, uh, I thought also the same thing. Also Sheena? <laughs> yeah, also the name is a bit misleading. Let me see if I can get a fight with one more nightmare. Cassius. Yeah, the Cassius keyboard. Yeah. What happens is you can go up to them in your castle and hit the demo. <sighs> One more night. Oh, well, actually, this. No, these things don't give it any good experience. If it says let go, you're not getting good experience. I'll take the one. The vines aren't that bad. The snap traps are the ones that don't give anything. They're close enough. Uh, let me just look at this again. Uh, Clown, Elsmeralda, Ivanov, Cassios, and then the pirates. Yeah, you're going to be like 60% done your recruiting. Getting there. Can I warp the pirate island? You could, but you probably want to go to town and uh, heal up first and get spell levels back and such. I used one. Okay, fine. But fine. My in is free. Man, why are you fast traveling everywhere? I feel bad because I, I, I am fast forwarding through most of the music, and this game has a very good soundtrack. If only I had a holy rune. Yeah, I know. If I could, I would just slap a holy rune on the main character, but I can't. Sometimes when I'm using, uh, when Victor's constantly putting your party, I just slap a holy rune on him. <laughs> I immediately just go back to fast forwarding again. Oh, right, Pirate Castle. I was supposed to do that. Did you really try to advance the plot? Yeah. <laughs> Pirates. Uh, I don't see this battle going well. Yeah, I'll be fine, actually. You'll be fine. Earthquake. Lots of earthquake. Yeah. And black shadow. I think those two alone will be enough to pull you through. Leonardo, Kanak. Yes, Black Shadow. We'll let you attack that guy. That guy. Earthquake, and then Unite Attack. The last one. So are these guys not joining you because you look more like a pirate than they do? Yes. Exactly, they don't want to be out-pirated. I mean, the one guy oh. there looks like a pirate. What's up? That's a spicy meatball. Mm-hmm. The earthquake spell? Uh, no. Oh, they're, what they do? Yeah, the basic melee. Well, it's a shame that they get one turn to act on. <laughs> it's weird. It's a weird decision by the game. <laughs> you know, I, I told grabbed, you that earthquake spell was I, good. I grabbed Hellion as like, ah, eh, fuck it, you know. Now that uh, Mother Earth spell is uh, spell Mother Earth rune is stapled onto her. I don't think you can take that off. Real talk. Wow, they're... Actually, let's have the Lich heal main character. Have the people 
who made this game ever seen an earthquake? No. Rock small, everyone does. It was supposed to be, I think it's supposed to be uh, like a rock slide, not an earthquake. Okay. Set up all this elaborate stuff. Main character, pop him on the head, win. You know, for never fighting before, that guy's a pretty good fighter. Oh, yeah. I was like, who are you talking about? Oh, right, the one fisherman who's never been in an actual fight in this game. I have to assume that he has speared a lot of fish, you know. You just, you just <laughs> do the motions, right? Yeah, but he, all he does is jump with his spear like the other guy's doing, so I guess he's just following his lead. Can I really recruit nobody in this town? The new place you're going to? Wait. Oh, right, because it counts that. What town is, what town is this? We got to Kirov. This is Kirov? Hmm. Yes. All right. There looks to be a pretty unique person to the left of where, where your boat is outside. Yeah, there's a lot of unique people in there. I'm just going to go by order so I don't lose track. I think you might be a man. I might have to crime you. Want to play a game? <laughs> Yes, 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 yes. How are we looking on time, by the way? Oh, I should do a cut. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. I'm going to do it right now. Okay. Next See time. You after crime. Next, next time, minigames.